Dear Worship Leader Series. Hello everyone, I am Olua Kemi Ugo Akeze and welcome to today's episode on Dear Worship Leader Series and I want to just say thank you for always connecting with us and connecting to us. God bless you. So today's focus is on excellence, how excellence works. Reading from the book of Psalms chapter 8 and verse 1, New King James Version. O oh Lord, our Lord, how excellent is your name in all the earth, who have set your glory above the heavens. What is excellence? Excellence is the quality of being outstanding or extremely good. That is a personality that is or our work also possesses an outstanding quality or outstanding qualities. Our God is excellent. See this Psalms chapter 8 and verse 3, the Passion Translation. Look at the splendor of your skies, your creative genius glowing in the heavens. When I gaze at your moon and your stars, mounted like jewels in their settings, I know you are the fascinating artist who fashioned it all. Wow, that's so sweet. An excellent person is one who possesses outstanding qualities, which can also be seen in the things she does and how she handles them. Daniel chapter 6 and verse 3, Then this Daniel distinguished himself above the governors and satraps because an excellent spirit was in him and the king gave thought to setting him over the whole realm an excellent minister is the representative of god he knows who and who he is distinguishes himself by standing out because he possesses an excellent spirit how does this excellence work how does excellence really work you must first value excellence before the spirit of excellence can come upon you then it flows to the things you do i mentioned three things there number one it starts from within excellent is not what you wish but what you work towards yes it has to be something you cherish in your heart first it was recorded of daniel that an excellent spirit was found in him excellent spirit small s and it begins from inside inner qualities this becomes easier as a child of God, having the Holy Spirit inside of us. So it should not even cross our mind at all to do anything less. Daniel distinguished himself. That is not pride. It's you knowing your worth. If you carry excellence, you won't deal with or play around mediocre. I am made for more. I am the head and not the tail. Number two, upon. When a desire for excellence has been established, then the anointing for excellence from God will come upon you. It distinguishes you and I from others. You will hear people say, ah, there is something about you. There is something about you. That is a statement attesting to the anointing of excellence that is upon you. They cannot see it yet, but their perception of you is excellent. Then the third one is on. You anoint my head with hoy and my cup runs over. That's Psalm 23. Now they're no longer saying there is something about you. They can now see the excellence playing out because you are, you are able to do things with excellence. You pay attention to details. You give your best. You are committed. You are compliant. No eye service. No man pleasing. You focus on the quality and not quantity. You are self-disciplined and self-motivated. You don't need to wait for someone to say you are doing well before you work on yourself. You are constantly improving on yourself. Your product goes through the right process. You honor people and you are goal-oriented. What is on you sets you apart from others. Excellence is like a light that cannot be hidden even if you try to hide it. Oh Lord, our God, how excellent is your name. <laughs> Him, God's name is excellent. How about the carriers? Not only the name of God, but also his spirit. Don't try to be the best. Try to be excellent. Trying to be the best will make you to compete. But trying to be excellent will make you stand out. For you to sit and stand with kings, you must be excellent. For your work to get to the palace, to the kings, it must be excellent. If connections per venture get you to the kings, 
It is your excellence that will keep you and sustain you. So dear worship ministers, as we serve the king of kings and the kings, that is God's people, let us be excellent. So till we come in our next episode, remain planted, remain rooted, and remain connected. God bless you. Bye.